orchestrate. Belanger, Bouchard, Belanger, all tied up, got a backhander off, he scores! Great shot! Admit it. Most of you couldn't tell me right now how many goals Eric Belanger has or who his line mates are. But maybe that's because he's one of those guys that just does his thing and doesn't ask for the spotlight. But before the season started, he knew this team was counting on him to provide points and leadership. For me, uh, it was really important to, to have a great workout in the summer, get ready for training camp and, and have a good start of the season. I did that in uh, maybe the last five or six games, the point. Uh, or not as there as much as I wanted to, but I'm, I'm playing. Belanger That's an understatement. Belanger. Last year, Belanger played in 75 games. However, he never seemed to really catch his stride, but he got off to a solid start by scoring two goals in the season opener against Boston. There's it back behind, Pierre-Marc Bouchard. Center shot, scores! Eric Belanger again! Yeah, last year was an adjustment for me, you know, being uh, the year before uh, going in four different teams. Uh, was hard on me and, and my family. So uh, when I uh, I signed uh, here with the Wild for, for three years, it was really good for me to be able to come here and settle down and uh, and feel good about uh, playing on the, on the on the city like this, where the fans are, are good and uh, where this organization uh, is trying to get better and, and win every year. Part of the adjustment for Belanger was just putting down roots before he came to St. Paul. He was with L.A., Carolina, Atlanta, and Nashville but he was with the Predators for just 24 hours. That was a situation that put a lot of pressure on him and his family. Uh, that was definitely hard on, on us. We went through it, so our marriage has been uh, way better since then. And uh, I had a really good time in Atlanta, and then in the free, in, in the free agent season, uh, as everybody knows, I signed a three-year deal here. So it was, uh, it was quite an experience. And, uh, like I said, we went through it and uh, it, for the for the better, I guess. Melange says now that he's in Minnesota with his family, it's brought stability to his life, and that has put his mind at ease, allowing him to relax and just play hockey. Uh, this is the most important, I think, as a player, to have stability, know that you're wanted by uh, by a team, and uh, this has been the way it's going for me here. And I hope, uh, you know, I still have one one more year. I hope I, I would be able to sign another long-term deal here because I really enjoy playing here and uh, it's been good for me and my family so far. The Belanger feels like he has a home. He's doing everything he can to help the team make the playoffs. And he has some words for those who don't think Minnesota has what it takes to get back to the postseason. You know, there's a lot of people who are doubting that the Wild can make the playoffs this year, but all the guys in the room believe that uh, we can do it. And uh, we've been playing some better hockey lately and we have to keep doing the same thing and prove wrong to the people that don't believe in us. Eric Belanger, motivator, family man, hockey player. For Minnesota Wild Country, I'm Benita Sokka. Fires a shot, rebound, he scores! Yeah. Yeah.